Hello there everyone and welcome back to the Fowls in the Week Reich. I'm your host, Mr. Mokalov, and right now, we've got a couple of German demands. During the Cox's collapse, our state took the chance and occupied territories that belonged to the Germans now. With the campaigns of reclaiming their former glory, the Germans are now ordering us to hand back those taken lands, which... I don't know, Reichsmarschall, substance abuser, dictator, fat man over here. I don't know, he's got a lot of manpower, but we got more than him. And technically, he's got 70 divisions. We've been training our own guys... And I've kind of figured that he would attack us eventually, so not today. Also, I'll screen. I decided to go attack just everyone else that we could who's not part of the faction. Um, we took out Saudi Arabia because we could, Iran, Iraq, Greater uh, Syria, Afghanistan, uh, even Pakistan just because we could. Uh, I actually went to war with India, but then they, these guys declared war on us, so yeah, we, we're definitely gaming here. Someone said in the comments from yesterday, and you know what? I love the NSGAP. Oh, the Goring Gallery. If you want to read about that, please go ahead. That's a lot of art he's got, but it must be an S collection, right? And we've also gone ahead and done, um, we went down to a extensive conscription just so we can build a little bit faster. Like, I would like like for us to build, 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 build. We need more things to build. Now, I do want to take out the Soviet Union, but if, if the false dictator wants to take us out, so be it, so. Also, the Soviet Union has 103 divisions. The Russian Republic's still doing well. Because uh, they're holding out for now. They've actually been pushing, it looks like, so that's kind of impressive. I just read this, so... No? Um... Not today, Herman. And see, now they're gonna go to war with us, which... You know, strange turn of events. Oh crap, Slovak Empire. Can we actually push in? They were doing relatively okay so far. And of course, once they throw their full weight of their army, then... Uh, well, we might not be doing so, so so okay, but eh, we'll see what happens. Okay, if we overrun them... I mean, I've literally done nothing to them. This is literally their entire army. Of course, they did have a civil war. Don't forget that. They did have a civil war. We might have roughly the same number of divisions. Once we encircle some of these guys here, like, it'll be real bueno. But we've got some other comments to go through, such as... So when I said, at the end of last episode, and this is about about, about the end of last episode, attacking without being prepared is a bad idea. You were completely correct, and that's why I ended the last episode when I did, just because I knew we weren't doing well. That's completely my fault. I take full responsibility for that. I just wasn't thinking then, so... Yeah, it is what it is. I apologize. How are we doing so well? Like, okay, I'll be honest. I made our guys 40 combo with because I knew they were going to attack, so... But still. Ooh, yes. Concentrate industry. Let's grab some... More base, yeah. We love the base. Nice. Head in. It gets those tanks, maybe, 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 maybe. Okay, let's go. this is much easier than I thought it would be. Yeah. I mean, we're trying to make quite a few divisions here, and we need way more guns. But once... Why don't you take over Germany? Oh, the UK recognizes the Delhi government. That's nice. Um, yeah, once Germany's gone, we should have more than enough factors to really just... Balbo takes power. Whoa. Because there was and Benito last time died or left or something, so... Alright, so we're not doing as well as we were earlier. We're taking a few casualties. We've killed quite a few of them as well, though. Like, this ain't too bad, man. This really ain't too bad. Some more fighters. There you go. Good luck. Do we have any spare planes at all? No, we absolutely have no extra spare planes, which sucks. Alright, so now I want you all to hold. If you want to about that, please go ahead. Udyaz wins. Nice. Okay, so now let them attack us, and we're going to concentrate our forces just a little bit more. There you go. That's fine. Yeah, they're definitely going to be attacking us quite a bit more now. Are they doing force attack or something? They're over river. We can't pierce them. Go in here. Well, if you can't beat them, just go around them. No, 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 no. Not today, you piece of garbage. Alright, well, we did well there. We've taken, what, 102,000 casualties versus 370,000? So, yeah, Goring. Yeah, not bad. Um, we just gotta make sure we do some really good encirclements. Front, large front operations, very nice. And do some strategic cycles. Nice. Very good. Hope you guys are having a pretty good day. I'm doing okay myself. Um, can you actually win there? That'd be great if you could. There you go. Should be able to win there so we can go over boom, boom, and circle, destroy, and have a good time. We have more than enough PP. War bonds would be bad. Um, uh, integrate more stuff, yeah. I guess my goal is really to take out the Soviet Union. I did not want to take out the Germans, which, because it doesn't make any sense for us to take out the, our fellow Germans, but whatever, I guess. Are they attacking anywhere else? Cool, because we will.
Going two. Nice. And we're missing some guns too, but you know, whatever. Uh You should be able to win there, man. They're only militia, man. They're only militia. Cool. And hold. Can they pierce us, huh? Well, we're going in then. You wanna pull crap like that? You can pull crap like that. You're going in. And you're gonna force the attack. Good. Hang out, hold out, enjoy yourselves. Because we're missing a lot of guns. 22,000, we did, we started off very strong. But, eh, you know, we're struggling a little bit. Recon's nice. Let's grab some better guns. Or, I guess, better guns. Ooh, that's smart by them to do that there. So we'll go here then. Destroy their enemy tanks. Can we not pierce them? That sucks. Seriously? Don't make me force attack. I will flip and force attack if I have to. Well, alright, you made the choice. If you don't want to win, then you're going to die on the line. The choice is yours. It's simple. It's simple. Win or die. Man, they really didn't recover after that civil war, did they? Alright, anything else? Yes. Vena Os Ostendorf. Slovak Republic is good, so all those divisions are now gone. We got more military factories, which is, thank goodness. We need way more entertainment. We need way more stuff here. Way, 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 way. Oh, some divisions too, look at that. SS divisions. But they're not really SS divisions. Not really, no. Go in if you possibly can. Oh, yes. That'd be so delightful. Nice. Go in there too. Circle and destroy. No, you don't. No, you don't. I think we've got him on the run. Well, hopefully. Nice. Yeah, I didn't expect to take these guys out within the first 10 minutes of the video, like, I'll be honest. We have probably more divisions than they do, so, uh, yeah. Weird. I would like to get some tank divisions, but that costs so much AP, uh, not APCs. Oh, it does cost a lot of APCs, but main battle tanks. Actually, we're doing okay on main battle tanks. New present for China? A new system for China. Nice. Any other upgrades? Level 4, 5, 6. Not bad, not bad. It does cost us a lot to get a new general, so we'll see what happens. Graz. Good, good, good. 400,000, some have lost. We've lost a lot of guys in the past few months, so. You should not be failing here. You quite literally should not be failing. I don't care how badly our divisions are hurt. Um, These guys, yeah, they're not great. I want to remove that. I do want to use more of these guys. Or just use them in general. So, yeah, they're not great. Can we get another APC? better. It's not great, but it's better. Now hold. And once you're done winning the battles, there's more planning for you. Nice. Hammer retarder. Very nice, very nice. Go hold. Five. Four. <coughs> three. One. Now we got some more max, more planning in, which is awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, yeah, we can't really pierce them yet, but it doesn't matter when they're completely encircled. So, oh Goring, oh Goring, you've made quite the mistake. Yeah, some of these divisions looking real bad, real nastiness. If you actually win there, that'd be awesome, because I want you to move here. And cut all these guys off if you can. Oh, cut that guy off too. That's nice. That's good. Bash production's good. Get some more resource efficiency gain. That'd be awesome. Guys, we don't need import any more aluminum from Hungary. Instead, we'll buy some stuff from Malaysia. Yeah, so it wasn't quite the first 10 minutes to take out Germany, but we're getting there. We're getting there. How close are they? They're about halfway there. We definitely have more divisions than them now, so anything we damage we do, they should not be able to... Recuperate, right? Right? Right. Not sure why they made that. There you go. Thank you. Look at those divisions. All encircled. No escaping to the Italian border, my friends. No, no, no. Not today. 
We actually have... Huh. Oh, we lost some convoys. That sucks. Yeah, we don't worry about that, guys. Any other upgrades? Four, five, six? Yes. Infantry. Uh, go scavenger. We might need that on the Russian front, so... Kriegsmarine, huh? Sub detection? No, I don't want to hurt us anything. Production costs? I don't mind a little more production costs, if that's the case. It's fine with us. <clears throat> ah. Don't you love it when a plan comes together? We've only lost a quarter million ish. 300,000 versus basically a million Germans have died. That sucks. But, you know, things have to happen. Make more civvies. Yes, please. We can make more millies. Yes, please. We're almost there. That was a lot of things. A lot of planes. Oh, hello. Yeah, I probably want to leave them alone, guys. There you go. Nice. And okay, I didn't expect to do this within the first 11-ish minutes, so... Yeah, not bad. I hope we get a lot of... Well, we probably won't get quartz on them, but whatever. Actually, don't do that. And it costs 300 political power to get in some guy Isidoros Erler. Not bad. But hey, at least we're under all the one true Reich. Right? And spear points, yes. But now, because we took them out, we should have more cities to work with? More millies, hopefully? Yeah, we're going to suppress a lot of people down here. Something like that. I don't know, something like that. Not bad. The real got Greta got to show Reich. Good, good, good. Support weapons, five. Grab some of that, two. No, it's a little bit ahead of time. Uh, we don't really need that one. Some better engineers, because he can. Cool, because as soon as we get some more guys out, we're just going to go straight to war. As long as we cover the line, that's what I really care about. But since we're here, SS yes, yes, Panzer Divisions, main battle tanks. Main battle tanks, thank you. Got some anti air on these guys. Grab some of that and grab some maintenance. Uh, instead of anti air, those signals. What's wrong with us? Good. You know, since we're here, anyways, throw them on the line. Three guys on here, too. I don't want to deal with them. Good. Oh, and it says Panzers. Very nice. You know what? We're going we're gonna go big or go home, right? Go big or go home. Get some more main battle tanks. Thank you. Nice. Um, if that's the case, I'm gonna convert like these guys are only there's only two of these guys. They're not really that bad, actually. Yeah, they're really not bad, but I prefer what we have here. I absolutely do not have enough stuff here. It's alright though. These guys will just hopefully be devastating. Just absolutely devastating. Come on, keep building, keep building, keep building. Let's throw in uh two more. What are we missing for this stuff? We actually have enough APCs, go figure. Guns looking not terrible. Medium tank destroyers, you're gonna do that first, I suppose. Let's get a ton more wartime casts. Nice. Excavation one. Get some more research speed. 90 days ain't too shabby. Oh, do we make a lot more divisions? <coughs> Excuse me. No, not yet. We're getting there. We're getting there. Very close. Very, 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 very close. What are you waiting for? Not enough equipment? Looks like guns, probably. Resistance is hurting us quite a bit, but that's not bad. We have plenty of motorized, plenty of support equipment now. There we go. Flesh it out a little bit better. Um, kind of three. We won't need these for anymore. Oh god, we need way more tanks than that. What the heck? Yeah, no, you come up to the top. All right, not bad. And come on, just just a little bit more. I just want a few more divisions out. Screw it. Just, just get out. Seriously, just get out. Just join the line. Train, and then we'll attack. We have 10 of these guys. Eh, these guys aren't great. Their armor is pretty bad. Less than 19 is pretty bad. Because, like, what are these infantry guys? They're, like, not much, but still. Cool. Nice. Not bad, not bad. We still have plenty of manpower, too. How's your resistance looking? Not too shabby. Another comment from yesterday was, put divisions in garrison mode? Well, if you haven't been around Hoi 4 in a while, we don't have garrison any more mode anymore. We have occupation policies, which basically this is garrison mode, so you got to choose a default law, and I put the Einsatzgruppe 
here to help uh, cover things, you know, put down resistance, which we all love the Onsats Koopa here, so. Mobile, just use cavalry. They're probably better overall. So there you go. Just use more guns for whatever we need here. Anti tank is looking so bad, though. Holy crap. And, ooh. Yeah, that's not looking very good now, is it? Go two more. Yeah, maybe we'll cut down this just a little bit more. Nice. Train two at a time, too. There you go. So now, we're looking not too bad on guns. On anti tank, we're looking a little better. And main battle tanks, we're looking god awful. APCs could use a slight improvement as well. Which, you know, we're doing pretty okay on them already, so. Uh, let's go down to 2 1. We have more than enough in reserve for now. It's fine, whatever. Guns are fine. Tanks are not fine. Let's grab some tanks and then we'll, then we'll go to war. Cool. Allow Diplo, because this is what I wanted to do for this episode. It's probably a bad idea to go to war, right? But I think we're mostly ready at this point. Like, yeah, we're missing a few things here and there, but still. Transistor computing, nice. Got some more decryption. Losses, 2,000. Quarter million versus... How is... How, what? You have 124 divisions, 1.46 million casualties, while they have a quarter million and they have up to 39 divisions max. In what universe does that make any sort of sense? Sure, guys, you can do that too. I guess we aren't covering the entire line, but still. Still. Women in the workforce. Oh, we need total mobilization. Uh, actually, that's not a bad idea. Go to total mobilization, why not? Now, we love women here. We love them so much, they're going to be in the workforce. Get in the workforce, women. Cool, and, yeah, not bad. 13,000 losses versus how many casualties? 120,000? That's, that's not bad. That's, that's, that's just not bad at all. Nice. Go, tanky boys, go. I want to make sure we got plenty of tanks, though. Just tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of tanks. Get some cast first, though. It's not bad. Could be better. Could be better. Yeah, I'm not going to give the Russian Republic anything here, though, so. You know what? Um, yeah, I don't want to deal with them. Just, we'll split up Russia. Maybe. Or just take everything. I don't know. We'll see. Any upgrades? And also, there was one more comment saying from yesterday. Just straight gaming. We're just gaming here, man. You, me, and... Happy Isidore Erler. Nice. We need more guns, huh? That all makes sense. Yeah, that makes too much sense. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. There you go. They keep making more military factories. We're going to need them. Fuel's looking good, though. We're doing quite well on fuel. Losses for them include 1.4 million from the Russian Republic and a third of a million from us. Nice. I'm going to continue forcing it. <coughs> Excuse me. Just force the issue. Just a little bit more. Cool. Bad idea, but whatever. Oh man, if we could get Riga, that'd be awesome. Yeah, I don't think they'll be able to stand up to this, especially on a two-front war like this, when they've been losing so badly already. So, a lot of divisions, but they must be out of equipment. Look at all that. Literally no guns. Literally no guns. It's a good thing they can't really steal from us, because we have no guns too, so. Take out Riga. Keep these guys in place so they can't move down here. There we go, the Riga Pocket. Well, they do have a port, but we're, we're focusing on that real quick lack. Nice, beautiful. Ah, uh, the, or the Kurlin Pocket, really. Kurzem? Kurzem? Not bad. And we're just pushing. Just pushing and defending, man. We need way more tanks, but whatever. We'll work on that. We already are working on... What? Whoa! Whoa! What do you mean? We need way, 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 way more tungsten. We're doing quite well in rubber, too. Thank you. 
Any upgrades yet? Four, six, six, three. Not bad. He's level three. That's pretty good. So far, at least. Good. What are these tanks? Busy. Vena Ostendorf. Very nice. Oh, we need some more millies. Yeah. Definitely need some fighters, too. Good, good, good. The Great Gottesherreich. Nothing like it, man. Nothing like it. Oh, yeah, I forgot to keep doing this one. Nice. Better APCs, please. Thank you. Some more upgrades, man. 663. No. Well, once we get Petrograd, they should fall pretty quickly. We've killed off a million of them, which is pretty good. We've done 70% of everything here, so... I'm feeling pretty darn good about it. I don't know about you all, but... I did not plan on taking out Germany, as well as the USSR in this episode. Just the USSR, in general. And I didn't plan on taking these guys out earlier off-screen, but whatever. It is what it is. Yeah, this has been a... This has been a kind of a wild campaign. It's not very long. See, Thousand Week Ride campaigns really don't last that long, which is a little... Actually okay with me. I'm actually okay, okay with that. I don't like super, super, super long campaigns, but like... There's enough here that keeps me interested, and it's it's fairly intense. And I love that we cut off Petrograd. Oh, yes. Let all these other guys lose a lot more supply, so. I think this is right. This is... Oh, oh, we got Auslan, yes! All right! That is a bit OP, but you know what? If the devs are watching, please don't take it out. I love it. God, any time you can play as Reinhard Heydrich. I love it. I love... Reinhard Heydrich? Can I say that? Of course I can. I'm saying it anyways. Reinhard Heydrich, he was just a misunderstood fellow. He just one of the best for people. Not his people, but still. He was so efficient. So efficient. His efficiency is something we should all look up to. Yeah, I prefer him over Himmler. Himmler is okay, but... But you know, that Reinhard, that blonde butcher, hmm. Handsome. He's a god of death. If you didn't know. Lose the stability, but more war support. So hopefully we can actually finish one of these things here. Fall of Pem. Oh. Thanks. Oh, thanks, guys. Um. Oh, we still have research. I, oh, we'll probably use Cons Command anyways. Whatever. Can we actually take these guys out? We got a little bit of time. We'll try it. Why not? But make sure we have enough supply. Supply's gonna be god awful through here. Alright, cut me civilian. Do some of that there. We'll attack him anyways because we can. Encryption stuff is very awesome. We're almost done with that stuff too, thank god. And. Industry. Nuclear bombs, maybe we'll get that stuff done. Nice. Nice. Chemical stuff, G series. And T series. And biological stuff. I'll grab some of that. We'll see what happens. Are we there yet on the line? Are we good to go? Almost, almost. Three, two, one. I got tired of waiting. I don't care. American general staff is not going to be enough to save them. Because they have 36 divisions. At the GGR, the GGR, the Greater German Reich, can't stand up to us. What makes you think you can stand up to us, guys? Oh, also, let's not forget, let's integrate. Moscow. 0.89, that's kind of sad, not going to lie. Women of the workforce? Oh, yes, please. Return the capital to Moscow. We've retaken Moscow, the old capital of Russia. Though it lies destroyed and in ruins. To move a capital back to Moscow would be a symbolic recognition of the restoration of the Russian nation. Oh, that's weird. Okay, I'm not sure why we get that, but okay. Like, alright. I can kind of dig that. Oh, Reinhard. Just do it when the Führer's will. Because he has fear. Losses. 8,000 versus 33,000. Not bad. And it should take that long to get a picture of these guys. But then again, I've been wrong before, so. And warp up again would be nice, but whatever. To whiz. If I have to, I'll just use cons commands for this stuff, so. Hmm. Into continental range. 
Our enemies are not limited to within Europe. There are many nations halfway across the planet that would like to see our integration from existence. We must improve our missile system to strike anywhere on the globe to counteract the threat. Nuclear power for civic use. Nuclear power can be used for much more than weapons of war. We can use uranium-powered energy plants to electrify thousands and even millions of homes with the right equipment. We should realize a dream of nuclear energy to further boost the economy. The Fingers of Tawaz, named after the Proto-Germanic God of War, the so-called Fingers of Tawaz are the real pride and uh, of the Gotisha missile arsenal. Able to bathe any place on Earth with fire of the sun itself within hours, the degenerate nations of the world will merely tremble in fear of the sight of our technological marvels. Expand nuclear plants. With God's land population growing, its electrical demands are only going to increase as well. We should expand our nuclear energy cap capabilities to accommodate the rapid growth we're projecting. I get more millies, huh? Get some more. Nuclear power plant, Tottenham. Look at that. In the worst possible case scenario, we must be prepared to throw everything at the enemy if sustaining Gauntland's existence is no longer possible. Let us serve as a warning that anyone who takes us off the map will be reduced to a radioactive rubble in minutes. And Gauntland space program. But just as we conquered our distant lands in the east, it is the destiny of the German people to conquer the stars. The final frontier of space will belong to the Aryan people at last. Um, I don't want to. I'll be honest. I don't want to wait this long. This is stupid. I would wait this long. Uh, so F A and focus. Dot no checks. I'm not gonna wait that long. There's no way in the world I'm gonna wait. Cool. I apologize for using console commands for like this, but like, I'm sorry. No, just no. Tottenham. The hand of the dead. Doctrine of Gotland. The hand of the dead is cold and cruel. The hand of the dead does not forgive or forget. The hand of the dead embraces all. Got such a space program. With modified German rockets, Gotland has announced the start of the Gotisha space program, aiming to reach space, seemingly matching Germany in terms of its technology. People of Gotland are thrilled, and soon Herr Hedrich will lead the Gotish people into the space abyss and claim it for the Gotland once more. Gotland will reach space. Oh, yes, please. Yeah, I don't understand why we have to do that to Oz. Yeah. Hey, get some nukes. Nice. But seriously, like, why? Like, we only start with literally one research slot, and we only end up with three, so. I get it, sort of, but. I don't know. I wish it was just better than that. Go, 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 go. I know supplies suck. I know supplies suck. Garbage, man. Garbage. Straight trash. Space disaster. Oh, no. Our space disaster has yielded terrible results, causing a major disaster. The rocket crash into a major population center, killing and maiming thousands and causing major upset within the ruling class. Reinhold Hedrich has paused the space program while the teams of scientists are questioned and fired. Oh, well, we tried. Why, why do you give up then? Just keep going. Let me look at these guys. They, just, they, just, they are fighting people who just literally just throwing their bodies at us. But, you know what? We like it when they throw their bodies at us. They don't smell very good, but it's fun. Thanks, India. I wanted to kill you too, but I guess it's not going to happen for now. So where's the capital? Oh, it's over here. Going in on, boys. Go on in. And the Russian Republic is gone. So, I think that's going to end us here. I don't think there's anything else for us. I think this was kind of fun. Even though some of these focuses were not, or for the requirements. But, hey, if you enjoyed the campaign, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Also, if you do ever see any mod where which has Ryan out of Hydrish, please let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.